A prolonged drought plus unusually high mid-October heat are a deadly combination. The wildfires tearing through the parched forests of central and northern Portugal have claimed dozens of lives and made many more homeless. Obviously, we would like to present our deep condolences to the families of these victims. As you know, Sunday was a day when all records registered this year were beaten. We reached the maximum of 524 fires, and today, since midnight, we have already registered a total of 110 fires. And over the border, fires raged in Spain's northwestern Galicia region. More than 100 separate blazes. There have been a number of fatalities, including two people who died when their car was trapped by the flames. Thousands have been evacuated. Much of the destruction here is not natural, but deliberate. In Spain, arsonists are said to strike every year. In the United States, copyright law allows for the fair use of copyrighted material under certain limited circumstances without requiring permission from the owner. Under the law, determinations of fair use take into account the purpose of the use, the nature of the copyrighted work, the amount and substantiality of the work used in relation to the work as a whole, and the effect of the use upon the potential market for the copyrighted work. Other jurisdictions may have similar copyright provisions protecting fair use or fair dealing. If you are uncertain as to whether a specific use qualifies as a fair use, you should consult a qualified copyright attorney. You have the right to take it down.